Okay, everybody, it's time. We're going to go to Wales. We're going to do it in four minutes. This is Rabbi's tour. Uh, Whistle stop with Russ. Um, so let's go to Wales, my friends. Let's go over to the land of my father's, well, one eighth kind of thing, because I'm an eighth Welsh. Anyway, so we are leaving Victoria. Put your seatbelts on. Make sure that you know it's rabbis, not rabies, not rabbis. Okay, you know that. So let's go up the M42, the Cotswolds. Let's go to Burford. What a beautiful Cotswolds market town. Lovely honey colour stone. Let's not spend too long here because we need to meow, go over the border. We need to go to Hay on Wai. Hay on Wai, the town of books. Book festival every year in May. Let's hope it goes on this year. Richard Booth in the 1960s came here, set up his own bookshop. Wow, what an amazing place. Please investigate. But don't spend too long because we're going to go meow. further into it. We're going to go to the Elan Valley where the Bromes flooded the valley in the 1890s. They needed some drinking water, like. Can't find any drinking water in Birmingham, like. Let's go to Wales and let's flood one of their valleys. Brummies, right? Okay, so the Inner Valley, and then we go over to Aberystwyth, isn't it? Aberystwyth, the home of Welsh speaking Wales, isn't it? Aberystwyth. Um, sunsets, Constitution Hill, you can climb up. Wow, what a great place. Lovely. Day two, we're going north, we're going to Snowdonia, my friends. We're going to a national park. National parks created after the Second World War. Clement Attlee, what a legend, what a hero. Socialist icon. Let's people explore their own country. Wow. Landowners, please open up your countryside to the people. Brilliant, what a great idea. It will never catch on. Um, so, yeah, let's uh, go to Snowdonia and um, let's go to visit Harlech Castle, the home of Owen Glendower, the last self appointed Welsh Prince of Wales, and not the current one who's, of course, not Welsh at all. Welsh people don't like that, but hey, this is what happens. Um, so, yeah, we're going to go and visit Harlech, then we're going to come back down to Aberystwyth, um, and then we're going to go on day three. Even further south, we're going to go down to Newquay on the coast. Newquay, beautiful coastal town in uh, in Wales. Um, one time home of that legend, the master of everything Welsh but in English, Dylan Thomas. Do not go gentle into that dark night. Do not go gentle into that dark night. What a great man. Um, so we're going to Newquay, then we cut across, uh, go down to Dinnerfer Castle. Dinnerfer was the home of the princes of Dehoibath. Uh, before the invasion of Edward I in the 13th century, when he um, made Wales the first English colony. <gasps> Controversial, I know, but I'm an eighth Welsh, I can say these things. Um, so, yeah, we go uh, from Dinefa, we go down to um, Larn, spelt Laugh Arnie, another one of Dylan Thomas's friends. Go to Brown's Hotel, see where he got pissed on a regular basis. What a wonderful place it is. Got a castle as well. Everywhere's got a castle in Wales. There are more castles uh, in Wales than there are anywhere else per head and per square kilometre. Wow, what a, great, what a great place. We'll make our way over to Tenby. We'll spend the night in Tenby in Pembrokeshire, Little England, beyond Wales. Okay, so day four, we're going to start um, in a 13th century chapel on the coast in Gunners Chapel. It's not an itinerary, it's a bonus. I'm giving you a little bonus because you're a nice bunch. So, wow, underneath the cliff, we have to walk down a few steps, count the number of steps. It'll be a different number on the way up. <laughs> it's true. Everything I say is true. I'm a tour guide. Everything I say is true. So, we're going to leave there and then we're going to go uh, to another castle. Well, actually, before that, we're going to go to St. David's. We're going to go to the smallest city in Great Britain. 2,000 people in St. David's. The patron saint of Wales, uh, 1st of March. Um, the only patron saint in these islands to actually come from where he's patron saint of. I know, unbelievable. Um, and then we're going to go to uh, Pembroke Castle, the home of Henry Tudor, a.k.a. Henry VII, father of the big black guy with the six wives. Uh, then we're going to go back to Tenby. We're going to get some um, pretty drunk in the pub, the Hope and Anchor, what a great pub it is, um, with the real local Tenby Ale. Wow, amazing. Uh, and then day five, we're going to get up bright and early. We're going to leave Wales, but not before. We've, uh, we've stopped off at a place called St. Fagans. St. Fagans. Ne can never remember which it is. Wow, open air museum, great place. Uh, and then we head back over the Seven Bridge to Castle Coombe in the Cotswolds. We go a little, woo, Cotswolds, lovely. And then back to Victoria and thank you, Catatonia. That's the tour in four minutes and 30 seconds. <laughs>